long time no barn vlog talk does that make sense anyways uh i'm headed to the barn right now it is 12 o'clock um it is currently may like 15th or 16th or something like that we're in the middle of may basically and i have not had a physical ride on my horse since my clinic in december so yeah i've lunged him a lot um like probably like at least once a week throughout the winter um and i've sat on him and walked him but i haven't actually like physically ridden in like basically six months so yeah um if you guys are new to my channel or if you've missed it i'll link the video down below kind of just explaining why i had a really rough winter with some like seasonal blues i didn't i'm not gonna say depression because i don't want to like give myself a title without being diagnosed but I had a really really bad winter in terms of being really sad um and school was busy and it was a really really cold winter here in Ontario and our barn isn't the warmest so uh yeah I didn't really get to ride much but school's over um work's been really crazy I've been working like 40 to 50 hour weeks right now because we had some people quit so yeah today's my day off um so I'm gonna head to the barn and I'm gonna ride I've been out to the barn a lot actually in the last few weeks just grooming though because I haven't really found the um like inspiration to ride yet so I'm heading out today even though it's a very cloudy day I don't really know why I picked today but I did and we're gonna ride uh alone uh yeah so that's gonna be fun I'm sure he's gonna be fine he's literally the chillest horse in the world but yeah hello everybody I'm currently vlogging on my phone mainly because it's starting to rain and I didn't want to bring my camera out with me to trek to get the pony it's the barn there and I have to go all the way to there so it's starting to rain that's great I'm gonna ride inside anyways because you know at least when you're inside you have walls to protect you in case you die so I figured that was a safer option he can see me coming he's literally staring right at me <laughs> he's like hi oh I literally groomed him like two days ago and he's already disgusting. I'm glad he's coming to me though. It's like he knows I'm not wearing boots. Hi, Bobs. Oh, good God. You a dirty pony. Hello, handsome boy. Mr. Oles. Feels like old fashioned to be vlogging on my phone again, but. Hi, handsome. His mane, I'll show you guys when we get in, but it's, I fixed it a few days ago because it was a mess. It was so tangly and I was like, you know what? The time has come. We're chopping her. We didn't actually, his owner and I are thinking about mohawking it, but we just haven't gotten around to it yet, but it's a lot better. So this is the moment you guys have all been waiting for. Bowl is all tacked up. I am getting ready to head into the arena. And I got my lucky gloves, which are these like funky ones. Those are I'm just going to bridle him and then we're gonna head out and ride. Hi! It's actually a really nice day outside. It's just overcast, but it's not raining. Look at your friends! Puddle, big jump. Oli is definitely not sure how he feels about this. <laughs> Stick you guys right here. Come on, let's walk and get settled. Come on. Also, super random, but I actually just started a workout because I'm curious to see. Um, how many calories I burn? So I'm gonna get on, I'm gonna walk around and put some music on to calm him down because that usually helps. And then, yeah, so I'm gonna move you guys into a better spot. We're
but we're gonna try and trot now. Wish me luck, I have no idea how this is gonna go. had six entire months off. Last time I rode was December 12th. I'm mind blown. What the heck? Also, like, let's keep in mind, it's not pretty, and I know that, but, like, I'm not cutting anything out of this video. Like, what you see is what you get. Nothing's being cut out. He's being an angel. I'm going to stop the ride here, though, just because he is really out of shape, but, oh, my God, he's so good. Bestest pony, is he you? I didn't want to ride him too long. I him for about 15 minutes just because he is really out of shape, and I wasn't even going to canter him, but he was being so good. He had a little minor spook that I didn't catch on camera, but guys, he was so good. Like, he's, he's seven and he had six months off. What did I do to deserve this? Such a good boy. Oh, you know it's raining. We should head inside. This what you want? Okay guys, so I just finished my ride. I'm back on my phone just because it's kind of rainy a bit. I don't want to bring my camera out, but we're walking back to the paddock, aren't we? He's so good. He's so good. I can't get over how good he was. Um, hi! Oh, that's my hand. We can't eat hands. This is the hand that feeds you and loves you, so don't eat it. Would, uh... It wouldn't be a normal walk back to the paddock if he did not drag me over to the grass to eat. Because, you know, he doesn't have a giant paddock full of grass or anything. Right? Goodbye. I love you. I love you. Bye. Goodbye. Goodbye. Have a kiss? Hey, give me a kiss. Thank you. Don't go. Goodbye, handsome boy. Aw, bye, bubbies. Bye. I love you. So I've been home for a little bit now. I just kind of changed into some comfy clothes. It's like a really rainy day here and I just don't want to do anything. But I wanted to come on here and kind of close out today's video and just kind of talk to you guys um, a little bit. Um, so like I said, I'm still going to be a barn vlogging. Um, just not every time I go to the barn, if you guys have not seen my video where I kind of, just, where I kind of talked about why I stopped barn vlogging, um, I'll leave that down below for you guys to check out because it's kind of an important one. But basically I'm only going to vlog when I feel like vlogging at the barn. Um, I'm not going to put any pressure on myself to set myself up on a routine and say like I'm going to barn vlog like once or twice a week because sometimes I just don't feel like it. Um, but today was a really fun day and I wanted to vlog and I'm so happy I brought you guys out with me. Um, 
And yeah, he was really good. Obviously, my position probably, I haven't looked back on any of this footage yet, but it's probably going to be pretty cringy. Um, but I wanted to share it with you guys just because I think Oli is so special and like he was off for six months and he's seven and he was so well behaved. There is nothing I'm going to leave out of this. There was, um, what you see is literally how he was. Um, and yeah, I don't know. I was just really, really happy with him. And I kind of wanted to come on here and just close out the vlog and tell you guys how good he was and how proud I am of him. Like I said, I only rode for like 15 minutes just because he was so out of shape. Um, but I'll build that up slowly. And yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give it a big thumbs up if you guys did enjoy. And yeah, I'll talk to you guys in my next one. Bye.